Friends, buddies, pals, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. This is day two of the trip. Look who's here. Hey, how are we doing? Me and Dave are back on the job. We were actually fished yesterday. If you haven't watched that, you should definitely click up there and go watch it because it just turned out to be pretty epic in the end. Hi. Stream of fishing in the rain. You had a you had a bad run of losing a fish. Oh yeah. So the mission today is to get Dave landing fish on video because you caught what two yesterday three uh, you landed two or three out of about ten i know right you yeah. had a schneider line going on yesterday oh, yeah. of just losing fish so we're going to basically walk straight up to where we finished fishing yesterday and we're going to then do a bit of a bush bash and then we're going to jump in the river and then do a fairly big day yeah 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 yeah, yeah. 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 okay big day so it should be about 10 o'clock by the time we get in sun should be poking up getting on the water Good times. Absolutely. Let's, Let's go. Do it. Yo, okay, we are here. It took us how long? Hour and a quarter? Hour and a quarter to get to this point. And from here on, we're just gonna set up and then we can fish our way up for the rest of the day. 20 to 11, sun's just starting to come up over the gorge and you can see it on the water up there. So it's pretty good timing. I'm gonna do the same as I did yesterday. I'm gonna have the nymph rod and the streamer rod and then kind of bounce between the two. I really wanna get more fish on a streamer. All right, so streamer rod, same as yesterday. Helios 3, six way F with the white hair. It's not really a handle, is it? With the white bit, I don't know. And then for the nymph rod, I've got the Helios prototype five weight that I've been running. Uh, worked pretty well yesterday, so no need to change it. All right, I'll bang this um, nymph rod together first. So we're gonna throw the Mirage LT size two reel and the burn orange on here. And as usual, that's got the scientific angler's amplitude, infinity smooth, camo line on there in a five weight and then on the end of that we've got loop to loop connection to a seven foot floating poly leader from Orvis down to a tippet ring and then we've got the leader built off of that and I think from whoops sorry everybody yeah from memory from yesterday I think I've got about seven or eight feet of 3x down to about three or four feet of 4x and then whatever my first fly was on top of that maybe 17, 18 foot of leader to my first fly. Plenty in here. Again, I won't bore you with the details of the setup. If you want to see that in detail and you haven't seen it, I'll link a video up there. Uh, I'll just break it all down for you. Okay, double Davy, stone fly, size 10, 101 from category three flies as usual. Pretty much my go-to heavy fly when I'm nymphing. And then we'll go 4X off the bend of that. So just something like a, I don't know, flashback pheasant tail, something like that, size 14. And then we'll chuck an indicator on there and that's good to go. And I will real quickly run you through the stream of stuff too because I keep forgetting. So like I said, six weight Helios 3 F. Uh, again, Mirage LT size two reel in kind of lighter olive color. And then on here, oh, I keep forgetting. Again, I said, I would do it, but I'll do it. I'll, I'll put it at the bottom of the screen now, the name of this line, because I can't remember. I can never remember. And then all I'm gonna do here is just tie up a section loop in this 16 pound fluorocarbon, take ends in the hip pack, and we'll go about four feet, I reckon, is what I was using yesterday. I'm gonna take my loop, pass it through the perfection loop, Pull that back through the fly line loop and job done. And then I'll tie my fly on the end of it. Couldn't really be any simpler. It's like the simplest way of fishing ever. 
I'm gonna use the same fly I was using yesterday, which is this cool game changer my buddy Dustin tied for me. You know Dustin. That thing just looks so good in the water and was getting smashed yesterday. That's wicked. All right, and then I'm gonna use a lefty's loop to tie my streamer on. Again, if you don't know how to tie that, I'll link a video up there with basically all the knots I use. And I'm pretty sure the lefty loop is in there too. Taken in the hip pack. Bob's already crushed on this. Let's go. All right, all right, all right. I'm gonna start from here. Try not to hook Dave. Yes! Yes! So aggressive! Turn, turn! Yeah! On the board for the day, Dave! Nice! Yeah! Super cool! Look at that. That's awesome. Oh yeah man. Great start to the day. Pretty good start, man. I'm pretty stoked with that. That was that was really cool. Took a bit of work in the water, but eventually found that fish. And then about halfway through the retrieve, just went boom, solid, just like hitting a truck. Ah, uh, cool. Well, I'm happy. And uh, that's in that game changer, bro. It is awesome. We like it. I really like this kind of fishing. It's really cool. You know what this reminds me of? Um, is fishing for Dorado in Bolivia. Uh, same kind of thing, kind of same kind of looking water, streamers, and then just real aggressive, solid eats. It's uh, it's really cool. I'm really enjoying it. It's my new favourite thing. So it's just not a rush to get on the water first thing in the morning here, because it's lunchtime almost before the sun even gets in the valley. This afternoon's going to be good, just as this water looks good. Oh, now the sun, oh, there's a fish. Yep, there's a good rainbow just down here, Dave. So, rock with the green bit on it. Yep. Two feet out, two feet up. Now he's just gone out to the right. He's now a foot up from the rock. Just moved to the right. Oh, there he is. Tail. Yeah, I saw his tail then. Yep, he's nymphing hard out. Right, sorry about this light, but it is what it is. Um, but we found a fish just down here on the inside. Dave's just shopping over to, you said dry dropper, right? Eh? Yeah, dry, maybe about three feet of dropper and a little lightly weighted nymph and that should do the job. It's a really good rainbow. Right? That was super unlucky. Uh, it sucks. Must have just rubbed him on a boulder. There's lots of big boulders in there. Must have kind of done that and then created a weak spot and then that was it. See you later. Okay, next one. Okay, found another fish. Halfway up the same piece of water. Uh, moving around all over the place. So they've just changed over to like a 3.8 mil bead and something smaller for that. Indicator about four feet deep. 
this fish will eat, see if we can get it done, get Dave on the board. So our cast quick mend up and then high stick it onto him. You don't want to lead him too much or you'll get dragged from that fast water. was super cool we actually got it done and that's easily the fish of the trip so far it's just yeah it's a super good fish well done man and uh tricky in this fast water like that was yeah that's hairy um yeah pressure's off yeah good job relax man. let's go find another one i see him Chase it. Chase it on it. He's on it. He's on it. Oh. oh. Yeah, he wasn't. He wasn't super, super sure, was he? Nice piece of water. Pull up on everything. Oh, yes! Sick! <laughs> Oh, that was awesome. That was so aggressive. Nah, it's a rainbow. I would like to catch a brown like this, though. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, that's mean. That's so cool. Just a wicked fish. Yeah, happy with him. Uh, yeah, that was that was awesome. That was a super aggressive eat. Um, yeah, you might even be able to pull one out the head there because I didn't really fish that. So have your lunch and catch another one.
such a good fish. Nah, it's not great. Him. Yeah, he's coming over for a look. Here we go. <sighs> wow, that seems to take forever. <laughs> Just time slowed down. He was in no rush. Size 16 pheasant tail. Got that cool that cool kind of bulbous jaw they have in here going on. Oh, come on, Nip. Oh, ah, yeah, he is a cool looking fish. Yeah. But I do love, I do love that jaw. That's such a cool jaw. Look at that. It's a wicked looking thing. What kind of shovel nose look? Um, oh, that's getting quite miffed there. I don't know how good this will be. But yeah, that just took ages. Put it a little bit to his right, quite a long way to his right, actually. It wasn't a very good cast. But then he just kind of turned and he came over and came over and then elevated and thought about it. <laughs> and then ate it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> thought about it some more and then ate it. Spectacular day. Look at this. Not cloud in the sky. It's wicked. But it's still not like, I'm not hot. I've still no. got my thermal on. Yep. And that wind kind of comes up and yeah, if it wasn't for the sun, that'd be pretty miserable, I think. Yeah, it's autumn. Oh, yeah, well, you, know, you have to have summer first. We haven't had summer yet. Oh, yeah, we're it's still it. spring, <laughs> still winter. Gotcha. All right, I'm going to biff some through the back of here with the streamer. And then I might just go and nip the... Uh... I might go and nip the head of it. See what happens. Oh, that happens. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Woo -hoo -hoo. dude, that was so aggressive. Just out of nowhere. Nice. First car just hammered it, man. You're back to that skinnier kind of uh, looking fish. Yeah. yeah. It's been a big fish in the day though. Yep. Super cool eat though. Wow, that was cool. <laughs> he pulled it right out of my hand. 
That was a really cool fish. Uh, I think I moved another fish beforehand, um, but that one I just cast way over the back, waited a bit, sunk the line down a bit, got it as deep as I could, and then about halfway back, just boom, again, just <laughs> hammered it. Just incredible day, just uh, so much fun. I don't think I've actually caught a fish on a nymph today. Hooked that one. Uh, oh no, no, I have caught one, but like having so much fun with the streamers. Dave had to retie, which is why I was fishing again. Looks like he's good to go. And then we'll just uh, keep on pushing up. It's 10 to 3, so we're kind of getting on in the day. So yeah, we'll fish it. We'll fish a little bit more. But um, yeah, we've definitely done the majority of the fishing. Dave's stuffing his face with blackberries. <laughs> found a fish, Dave has handed a shot over to me, which is very, uh, very gentlemanly of him. I'm gonna say dry dropper, so I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take the last rig I had on off, uh, just cause it's a little bit light for the situation here. So we're gonna go that tan Chernobyl, about two and a half feet of forex down to flashback pheasant tail. Yeah, it should work. It should be fine. I'm not expecting him to take the dry flight at all. It's just there to present the nymph, to be honest. Take it in the hip back. Let's have a go. Oh, that was last minute. Saw it late. Chased it, ate it. There's two more fish down there, Dave. There's fish everywhere. Oh no, no, no. Oh. Whoa, that was very close. No, I don't want you over there. Oh, dude, thought it was close before, <laughs> it was closer. God, it's just so strong, man. Let's 
scrappy. <laughs> Just cool, eh? That is a specimen of a fish. <laughs> Just a beautiful fish. Perfect, eh? Perfect. Don't need that. <laughs> uh, if that fish had been a pound bigger, uh, there's no way I would have landed it. He would have gone into that tree over the back there and it would have, uh, it would have bust me off or gone downstream. So that was just a perfect size. Nothing wrong with it. Mid condition. It's brilliant. If that's the last fish I catch today, I'm a happy man. A size 14 tricky situation. I think you'll eat the dry. So I'm gonna go single dry fly. Nothing else. See what he does. Take ends in the hip back. This will be my last fish of the day, I think. Single dry fly. on this, I don't know if you can see on here, it's a tree. Yeah, it got me tangled around that, so yeah, I was yeah, lucky, lucky to get that one done. Ah, oh, sweet. I'm quite happily done. I'm quite happily done. That was awesome. And that was a size 14 tricky situation. Great fly. All right, we're gonna go one more piece of water. Um, big pool up the top there, we're going to look in that, see if we can get David fish, then we're going to put everything away and then just put our heads down and just walk and walk and walk. I don't want to do it to be honest with you, I'm not going to lie, I'm not looking forward to it, but them's the breaks. I do like fishing, I do like catching fish and seeing cool places and that involves a lot of water. Anyway, so we'll do this last pull, pack everything away, boost back to the hut, Probably be an hour and a half, maybe just over. Maybe an hour 45 to get back. Um, by which time I'm gonna be hungry. Yep. It's 
Oh, day. Okay, um, so that was the last piece of water. Dave lost another fish. It looked like a good fish too, and then I lost a fish on a streamer after that. Oh, yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. oh, he's off. <laughs> we've completely overdone it with time. Um, and we've now got a really long walk back to the hut. Which will be fun, eh, Dave? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, right, so we're going to do that. We're going to get moving and catch you back at base. Boom. And just like that, another day done. Food was amazing. Shower was probably even better. Just gonna sit down, chill out, maybe have a whiskey and relax. Just enjoy the place again. It's just been an amazing day. Another epic, epic day. Streamer fishing was just off the charts. Some dry fly eats, some nymphing. Dave had a couple of speak of the devil. Dave lost a few fish today. Only one. <laughs> <laughs> but you also got fish of the trip, which was a beautiful fish, so. Hey, count one of all. <laughs> Ebbs and flows, eh? Anyway, we're going to sit down, chill out, have something to drink. Hope you enjoyed this one, guys. Give me a thumbs up. Drop me a comment in the comment section below. And all that good stuff. Say so see you later, Dave. See you, guys. Have and a great, girls. And girls. Have a great weekend, guys. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.